We have just defined a function capital F of x by using the integrals. Integrable function f है उसको हमने use किया है for integral of a integrable function real valued function है उसको हमने use किया है function define करने के लिए और and we have seen that that function is Lipschitz continuous in fact तो Lipschitz continuity जो है वो imply करती है continuity को अब हम उसकी differentiability जो है वो discuss करने लगे हैं so differentiability of the function f capital F of x equals integral c to x f of t dt इसको state करेंगे और proof करेंगे if f is integrable on the closed interval a b and c is between a and b then f of x इस तरह define किया हमने by using the integral dt is differentiable this function f of x is differentiable at any point x prime in a b where f is continuous जहां जहां पे f continuous है Furthermore, f prime, the first derivative of capital F, जो कि हमने by using integral define किया है, f of x not equals f of x not होगा. अब end points पे a और b पे हम separately discuss करेंगे. If f is continuous from the right hand side, right hand side पे ही हो सकता है, then limit x approaches to f from the right hand side, ये हम notion हमने identify, defined की हुई है, f prime equals f of a and from the left hand side of B, limit, evaluate करें, F, first derivative of capital F की, वो F of B के equal है, इसको proof करेंगे, इसका proof जो है, वो इस चीज से start हो रहा है, अब इस integral को F of X not, in fact, इस integral के equal है, how this is possible, remember that F of X not, X not कोई fix है, that will be a real number, ये क्या है, this is a real number, now integral, from x0 to x, जो है, a real number, जो के constant है, ये बाहर आ जाएगा, f of x0 dx, ये constant 1 का integral क्या होता है, we know that, ये x minus x0 होता है, so this integral, this integral, in fact, turns out to be this one, ठीक है, अब उसी से ही मैंने divide कर दिया, अगर इसको मैं divide कर दूँ, x minus x0 से, so I will have f of x naught. So we can write f of x naught in this way by using this integral. So f of x minus f of x naught क्योंकि मैंने ये साबित करना है कि f dash x naught equals f of x naught है तो मैं f of x जो के मेरा इस तरह define किया गया है f of t dt इसको मैं consider करता हूँ f of x minus f of x naught जो के मेरा क्या बनेगा c to x f of t dt minus c to x not f of t dt ये मेरा बनेगा divided by x minus x not तो ये this whole thing is divided by x minus x not और minus क्योंकि मैंने इसकी limit लूँगा limit when x approaches to x not और साबित ये करना है कि इसका derivative ये अगर limit exist करेगी तो ये capital F का derivative बन जाएगा और इसका absolute value रूँगा तो अगर इस this limit less than epsilon में show कर सका तो F dash X जो है वो X naught पे वो F of X naught के equal आ जाएगा तो so this is the idea so this thing minus minus F of X naught जो है ये मैंने consider करनी है अब ये F of X naught को मैंने पहले इस form में लिखा है जो last slide पे मैंने explain किया था so I am going to write this one जो के exactly मैंने explain कर दिया है absolute value जो है वो मैं इसकी ले लेता हूँ I will apply triangle and inequality that will be less than equals to this one f of t minus f of x naught since f is continuous at x naught x naught पे जो है f continuous है therefore there is for each epsilon greater than zero a delta such that f of t minus f of x naught ये continuity की definition है if x minus x naught absolute value less than delta हो इसको मैं use करता हूँ यहाँ पे so that will be this thing this thing will be less than or equal to 1 over x minus x naught into x naught x epsilon dt epsilon constant है this will become 1 over x minus x naught, x minus x naught, epsilon, that will be cancelled out, 
So this thing is less than epsilon when our x minus x naught less than delta. Hence, f dash x equals evaluated at x equals x naught. Wo f of x naught ke equal hai, jo ke humne prove karna tha. So we have proved the differentiability of the function capital F of x equals jo ke defined kiya gaya hai by using the integral. The function not only differentiable hai, furthermore, agar at x equals x naught pe f continuous hai, to f dash capital F ka derivative evaluated at x equals x naught equals small f evaluated at x naught. Ab is statement mein, theorem mein, iski a or b pe b differentiability thi, jo ke aap hud se karenge.